What is going on, Multiversers? Welcome back to the channel. So, unfortunately, we got some bad news. We have some bad news, I know, but uh, I, I got a little, uh, like a tiny bit of good news, I guess, to try to help offset it somewhat. But uh, yes, in case you didn't see yesterday, Multiverses did officially tweet this out. The gods have spoken and Black Adam is not quite ready for Multiverses. Basically, the Black Adam update where they told us it's going to be a massive update has been delayed. Yeah, I know it sucks. It sucks, but... In the end, would you rather have a broken product or would you rather have it a little bit more polished? And especially if it's a massive patch, yeah, I'd rather have things a little bit more polished. And to expect a character releasing every two weeks is kind of crazy, wasn't it? Was that kind of crazy to expect? So if the character's not ready, they're not ready. I can still play multiverses in the meantime. So yeah, I still got to get a little bit more candy so I can get that calico cake. Who else is uh, anybody else finish the Halloween event and get all like all the Halloween stuff, let me know in the comments. But uh, yeah, so Black Adam and that whole update have been delayed. Well, how long has it been delayed? Well, at least at the time of recording, um, we don't really have a necessary, like an actual time frame. But uh, Player First Games tweeted this out, and uh, it's interesting kind of what they didn't say. So here's their tweet. We are actively working to ensure everything is up to par so that Black Adam can properly shock the multiverse's meta. We apologize for the wait and we'll continue to work hard to satisfy you all. Thank you for your patience. So the only I think one thing that I took away from this was I at least, you know, they said it at least. Right. I, I would hope they would <laughs> say that uh, it's not ready. But uh, the one thing that I kind of really took away with from this was they didn't give like a, a, a time frame. And maybe maybe they yeah, maybe they themselves don't know when the update will be ready. Could it be next week? Could it be in two weeks? I, I, I don't know. So uh, th th it could be it could be a little bit more of a delay because I don't know if if the character itself is the whole if if Black Adam is the reason that this update isn't ready. Couldn't they have just delayed Black Adam itself and then give us the rest of the update? You know, whatever arcade mode they said is coming, whatever else might be coming into the game. Couldn't they have, like, given us all that stuff and then just had Black Adam come out a week or two later? It could have done that, but I, I guess I'm kind of re maybe I'm reading too much into this. Maybe there's more of it that just wasn't ready. So if it's not ready, oh, that sucks. But uh, yeah, it doesn't look like we have a time frame for when we can expect this next update again it will be massive but uh uh we got uh, one of the devs who work on the game res lived here who uh tweeted this out yesterday too this is rough but we needed the time i just uh i think this patch more than any other will be worth the wait just gotta get there so yeah it does sound like something wasn't ready or they came across some sort of bug or snag or something that is holding up this whole update so they do re reiterate, though, that uh, it's going to be worth the wait. So we'll have to wait and see what ultimately comes of it. So it does suck, but maybe it's for the be Maybe it's for the better. Maybe it's for the better. So how about a tiny bit of good news? Tiny bit of good news here. So I guess this can do with spoilers. So if you want to stay away from that stuff, you know, uh, there's the end of the video. Thanks for coming. See you later. But uh, we are talking about uh, the data miners here, and uh, they're kind of giving us a little information. So first tweet from Lysool here, and this is speculation. This first tweet is all speculation, but here it is. This has to do with arcade mode a little bit. Lysool says, speculation, the water tower, like the, the Animaniac stage that uh, a lot of people associate Animaniacs and the WB water tower. So the water tower stage may arrive as soon as this week's patch. Obviously, the patch got delayed, but its placement in the, um, the original soundtrack right before the credits indicates that it might uh, act as the final stage of arcade mode. Water tower and water tower 1v1 strings were also added last patch. So the water tower stage is coming to the game, which is nice. It's going to be a very cool, iconic place that we get to battle around. I can't wait to see the stage itself. But um, yes, Water Tower seems to be getting, you know, worked on and we seem to be getting closer and closer. So again, the speculation is because the original soundtrack has the Water Tower song at the very end, you know, right before the credits, they're saying, OK, maybe that's, you know, the Water Tower could be one of the last stages for arcade mode. You know, kind of as a, hey, cool, this is the only time you get to play as it. Although I hope 
it becomes an actual stage as well, and it's not just for arcade. Because I think, I don't know, how would we feel about an arcade-only stage? Like, if Water Tower was an arcade-only stage, I think people would be kind of mad. Because then they could release it later, but maybe they have a specific design, a specific Water Tower stage, and then, like, it says a Water Tower 1v1 stage could also be for, you know, actually playing the game during casual or a ranked or something. So maybe two different versions of the map, one for arcade, one for... Um, just normal play that could be kind of cool as well but uh one more thing here about uh arcade mode so uh we do know th that uh, the i forget which data miners told us this but there's going to be a secret boss at the end and we now know who this secret boss is it's actually rain dog <laughs> yeah i know okay so hold on here's the details though here's the details lysul tells us it would appear that the secret boss of arcade is named rain dog and is indeed a rain dog with the following extra stats moves at 1.5 times the regular speed twice the normal size does 2.5 times normal damage actually takes reduced damage and knockback and then has 40 armor that's that's a lot of armor already take reduced damage and knockback and you have 40 armor. oh boy this actually sounds like it's gonna be like a legit boss like this is gonna be tough to beat so can't wait to see it but uh, the exact numbers could change at the arcade launch you know these are just the values as of right now when they posted the this uh, tweet the other day so yeah rain dog is gonna be the final boss but it's gonna be a an extremely buffed up souped up version of rain dog and let me let me say this i i kind of hope that this rain dog boss has its own unique skin just as the boss as a boss dog the rain dog boss whatever the alpha dog if you will so that'd be kind of cool and then you know if enough people want it then they could make it an actual skin in the game but it would be kind of cool to have rain dog having a boss only skin for arcade just to kind of show its dominance you know that'd be fun kind of fun but uh, either way that is kind of it for today Yep, delay. The update has been delayed. How long? We don't know. But we got a little bit more information about arcade mode with little speculation in there. But either way, that is going to be it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I guess I'll see you when I'm looking at you.